Hi everybody, Paul here again. If you're a do-it-yourselfer, then sooner or later you're probably going to use a can of spray paint for some kind of project, so I want to share with you two really important tips about aerosol paint cans. The first one is a safety tip, and the second one is a money-saving tip. So the first tip is don't forget that all aerosol paint cans are under pressure. So whatever you do, and I can't stress this enough, do not leave them exposed to heat. If you do, they can become overpressurized and explode. Someone left this aerosol can in a vehicle on a hot summer day. The can exploded and went right through the window. This could cause serious bodily injury to anyone inside or outside the vehicle. Someone left an aerosol can in this vehicle on a hot summer day. The can exploded and blew out the entire rear window. Again, this could cause serious bodily injury to anyone inside or outside the vehicle. The second tip is as soon as you're done with an aerosol paint can, whether you're waiting for it to dry in between coats or you're done painting and putting it back into storage, always remember to clear the spray nozzle. If you do not clear the spray nozzle, then paint will become permanently clogged inside the can and the spray nozzle. This means you'll be unable to use whatever paint is left inside the can and it'll be wasted. Now I'll demonstrate how to clear the spray nozzle, which is really easy to do. First, let's pretend like I just finished painting. To clear the spray nozzle, Hold the can upside down and push down on the spray nozzle until a clear mist comes out. Continue holding the can upside down and wipe all the paint off the spray nozzle where the paint comes out with a clean cloth or a paper towel. Continue holding the can upside down and push down on the spray nozzle for one second to do a final clearing. Continue holding the can upside down and wipe all the paint off the spray nozzle where the paint comes out with a clean cloth or a paper towel. Now you're all done and it'll work like new again. My woodshop teacher taught me this back when I was in sixth grade. It's always worked and I've never run out of pressurized gas from clearing the spray nozzle. I hope you found this helpful and if you like this video please hit the like button below, share it with your friends and please be sure to subscribe. God bless you and have a great day. Bye for now.